yesterday. One old mechanic with gray hairs. I know, uh, probably he... Uh, yes, over 60, the, that's true. Really old mechanic with a lot of experience walking with car, with sports cars. Also, he built it and rebuilt it the engines for them and he walking with his son. And thing is, he approached to the garage, I was in a garage, and um, he asked me how your Swedish cars, in which condition they right now. But before his son also asked me all that time, all that day, they also asking something. Patrick's garage. Grab your snack, welcome back. And I say that cars from 60s was more better than cars from 70s. And I've noticed that it was really hilarious for him because he asked me that more, more you know, he said me, you know, modern cars like my gloves. <laughs> now, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do click the subscribe button and notifications bell, so that way you can be notified as soon as I upload new videos about car repairing. He was with his disposable gloves, he using these gloves all the time when he walked because he wanted to save his skin in pristine shape, probably. And he said to me that modern cars like disposable gloves. And uh, this is uh, said, uh, this world was uh, from mouth of mechanic with a lot of experience. experience. He worked with old cars in olden days, not now. And he worked right now with modern cars and he said me this was that modern cars like disposable gloves yes i said uh, what means that you can't repair them you uh, can't uh, treat them and they don't care they have a limited longevity so and uh, he added that these cars, like yours, was really cars, but now disposable cars. Like a lot of things in our days, you can across a lot of things which disposable now. I want to add this for me, disposable music and disposable cloth and disposable a lot of uh, things in, in which they producing now during during the greediness of manufacturers disposable things just uh, plant obsolescence <laughs> like they say more faster this will broken more faster you go and buy the new things so they don't care about a uh, long to extend long period of time so things will be dependable a lot so we can use these things a lot period of time no 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 they so greedy that they prefer to produce things with limited longevity and modern cars modern cars also with long period longevity not me making out this they say to me old mechanic with a lot of experience with different types of cars with trucks, engines also, he 
rebuild their engines for trunks, for cars, for sports cars also, and he uh, have knowledge. He learned about this world, and he not just me, average driver want to repair a car. Because I have no knowledge as mechanic, I'm just average driver and I want to repair any things uh, with my car, if any broken things I know, and I want to repair just for my own pleasure, I repair things. But he is a professional mechanic with knowledge and with a lot of experience with work with working with different types of cars and he said me this is just disposable gloves about modern cars and yes i was uh, in a quandary why uh, this so modern cars uh, people go to deep deads for buying new cars, but these cars have limited in longevity. They are limited. They can't work forever. Modern car can't work forever. Not any car. I think really expensive luxury cars, also stuff with a whole bunch of electronic to increase their price. And this comes just from greediness of manufacturers. They want to earn more money and you're more faster. After a warranty period, your car will broken, they don't care about your car, you go and buy new car again. And I want to repeat this. This not me. I'm not making out this stuff. This was said by professional, reputable, with gray hairs, old mechanic with a lot of experience. He have ability to compare what was long time ago. 50 years ago, 20 years ago, and right now. And he said me that these cars can't work in, they can't work in forever. Like my old cars, you can repair them and they will work in. But in case with modern cars, you wanna go and buy the new car <laughs> for 40, 50 grants if you want a new car and it will be working and in, in a good opportunity, they are good opportunity, they will working under warranty period, but in this period also they will burn oil, you know, a lot of cars with weakest engines, they put turbos to these engines and they start burning oil, even under warranty, you can believe me. This was with my Volkswagen, which I worked as a driver with these cars, and they burn oil. And my car burns oil, and uh, nothing you can do with this, even under warranty. But uh, they think that uh, when they change oil, and uh, a level of oil uh, will be more lower in deep stick. You see this, when you go to change oil, this level will be lower even if you don't have to to add a little bit oil every time and thing is if you have jar with oil in the trunk that means you add oil so when you see cars with jar in the trunk with oil you always suspect about wrong 
engine condition. It's not wrong engine condition for their modern thoughts about uh, good condition of engine, but I know that my engine not burns oil 50 years old engine. It not burns oil, but a lot of modern cars, they burn burning oil all the time. And you know, if you want to go to see car, just the thing you want uh, probably to buy new car which was used before you, you notice that if you can see from this is enough uh, one glance what inside the trunk, and you see jar with oil in the trunk, that means that owner adds the oil to the engine. That means engine burns oil. Do you want to rebuild this engine or not? Or you want to take from junk the engine and put? And probably it will work. I'm not making out anything and I know this from old mechanics, but I know from my own experience this thing. But these old mechanics also saying me what I know before. And he also, I remember, said me about ignition a lot of things when my hood was off. He said me a lot of information which I was learned before.